Hello everyone and welcome back to Lewis News, your number one YouTube channel for all types of Spider-Man news. And in today's video, we are going to be talking kind of a universal rumor that has been going around over the internet in the last couple of days. And that is that MCU Spider-Man 4 apparently is set to release next year. Now, once again, this is a rumor, so make sure to take it with a grain of salt because this may end up not being true, but this may end up being true at the same time. And a bunch of people have come out and spoken about this. They've spoken that this is a rumor, but however, it is coming from multiple different sources that apparently that Spider-Man 4 is meant to release next year, which I think is really interesting because recently we've had rumors over the last couple of months that apparently MCU Spider-Man 4 is going to start shooting at the end of this year. And because it's going to start shooting at the end of this year, and they're going to shoot through to next year as well, the film will end up releasing in 2025, most likely in the summer of 2025, because that gives them enough time to shoot the film at the end of this year, going through into probably January, February, March next year. And then they obviously they have the whole year to edit the film, do the VFX, etc., do reshoots, whatever they need to do. And then the film will be set to release for summer of 2025. Those were the initial rumors surrounding the release date of MCU Spider-Man 4. However, now we are getting rumors. Apparently, the film will just release next year, which I don't know about you, but that seems a little bit suspicious. We do know that Kevin Feige has confirmed that they have just started putting pen to paper, meaning that the ideas for the film are down, the treatment for the film is complete, and if you don't know what a treatment is, it's essentially just the idea for the film, the plot, the character arcs, and everything like that. So they are currently writing the film at this moment in time, which means the final draft isn't that far away. And we also know, according to the rumors, if they are to be true, that pre-production does start pretty soon for the film, more towards the latter half. Now, does this rumor have any validity? Validity to it, could this film actually release next year? Well, yes, it actually could. And the reason why is that if this film is to start shooting at the end of this year, we could be potentially seeing a 2024 December Christmas release date for MCU Spider-Man 4. And because the rumors do suggest that the film is shooting in winter time at the end of this year, maybe it's a winter film, maybe it's set in a winter setting, therefore it releases in the winter of the next following year. The same thing obviously happened with Spider-Man No Way Home because that is a winter movie. It came out in December of 2021. However, that was a one-off because of COVID. The initial release date for Spider-Man No Way Home was in fact July of 2021, but it got pushed back obviously because of the pandemic. And the usual release date for Spider-Man movies tends to be mid-July, that kind of summer range, which is why the initial rumor of it releasing the following year in 2025 after it finished shooting in that kind of July range was all the buzz. But now people are saying that it releases next year but the only way it can release in 2024 to give them enough time to actually edit the movie and do all the vfx shots will be in christmas time because christmas time is the only time in 2024 where they would make enough money compared to the summer it is also the only time where they could have enough time to make and do the rest of the movie in editing and vfx as we did say so maybe it does come out next year maybe it's a christmas film maybe it's set in the winter who knows but make sure to tell me in the comment section down below what do you think about this? Do you think that it will release in the winter or do you think it will release in the following year in 2025 in the summer, probably July? With that being said, thank you guys for watching. Make sure to subscribe so you can stay up to date with all types of Spider-Man news. If you enjoy Spider-Man content and you want to stay in the loop with all types of Spider-Man news from the games and movies and the shows, make sure you're subscribed and have the bell notification on because we post all types of Spider-Man news on the channel and this is the channel for you. With that being said, thank you guys for watching. I'll catch you guys in the next one. Take care and peace.